All right, we're watching season five, episode five of The Mindy Project. So let's get started. Okay, well, Mindy doesn't want to go to the play. I would love to go to the play. I haven't gone. Like, my favorite play was Hamlet. I want to go again. It was in Stratford, Canada. It was so good. Mindy's on her phone, and she's like in the front seat. That's very rude. The actor is glaring at her. <laughs> He's just so annoyed. Oh, God. You've been on that bloody mobile for the entire show. Excuse me? Me? I like that he noticed. You know, it's funny. It's cute. I ship so many people. That dude is so annoyed. He's making her give him her phone. What is this? Kindergarten? He's gonna drop her phone into a pitcher of water. But he didn't. Oh, nope. He just threw it. I was to that guy. His name is Leland. And his last name is Breakfast. Jeremy's nickname in college was Princess Wanker. That's not friendship, dude. Mostly. A Did he just say he likes nudes of Mindy? Oh gosh. That was a very sexy Dude, he's flirting with her. Hardcore. You were extremely mean to me in a public setting. That is the best. My favorite. All my ships start that way. Darcy, Anne and Wentworth, everyone. He must be back on the opiates, says Jeremy, because he was into her. And by he, I mean Leland. Has anyone heard of Leland Breakfast? Is that like a pun on some actual person? Dr. Universe? Leland Breakfast is Dr. Universe. Is that like a play on Doctor Strange? Because Doctor Strange is cooler. It's Benedict freaking Cumberbatch. No, but yeah, that Doctor Universe. That looks a lot like the Doctor Strange poster. Okay, Mindy likes him now because he was in a Marvel movie. And he knows people. Oh yeah, Mindy, don't you dare leave Ben. He's the freaking best Jersey dude ever. Ever. The first genuinely nice guy she's ever dated. Aw, oh, the southern guy is still offended that he got rejected by Mindy. I still can't believe that happened. They had so much chemistry. Her boyfriend got Mindy a book. That's sweet. All those book of poems. I don't like poems. Oh, great. He is a fan of Leland Breakfast, too. He collects dolls. Oh, unless they're action figures. Those are cooler. I used to collect dolls. Nah. The southern stereotypes in this. Who's Jen Train? Dr. Kimball Kinney's going on a date. Oh gosh. Jody's going on dates with married woman again. One. Morgan doesn't know who Donald Trump is. Two. Ben has another girlfriend. Please tell me Mindy's not the other woman again. I'm sure there's a misunderstanding. There's gotta be a misunderstanding. That's a twist. That's a twist. Aw, Jody wants to move. Move practices. Not like move cities. We haven't really talked about it. Ben is hanging out with Mindy. You give me a book of hanging out? And hanging out with Lisa? And here I thought he was a good guy. Once a Kimball Kinney has made a decision, the duck is in the dog's house. What does that mean? I'm very glad Mindy is not letting Ben come to the Leland breakfast party thing because uh-uh-uh. You're that cheeky bent with more curves than the Swindon roundabout, aren't you? I was planning on going on my Jack Jones, but I wouldn't mind taking you out for a spin. That's a Leland dude. That's a hot profile picture. Okay, so no Ben, yes, Leland breakfast. Oh, Dr. Universe is so Dr. Strange. He can manipulate time, like... Same thing. Oh, my dog butt scoots too. It's fun to watch. Morgan wants a tip for his advice to Ben. Oh, he has a place in England. Wait. He lives in Downton, Downton Abbey? He lives in Downton Abbey? Oh, okay, Jody didn't get the job. A Korean medical robot got the job because it causes less drama. Good choice, good choice. It's true, too. You look like a fit Abe Lincoln. Leland Strange. He's such an attention hog. He literally cannot stand when people don't pay attention to him. Vague power comes vague responsibility. Leland Strange thinks Jody is a girl, like, by the name. He's like... So he's dedicating his song to little Jody. Ben's here. Ben's at the party. Jeremy has nice big windows in his apartment. Oh gosh. Mindy's wearing her son's pull-ups because she doesn't have underwear. Oh, please no. The new doctor, the new female doctor, and Jody are in a bathroom together. What's gonna go down? Oh, there we go. They're having a conversation. That's good. She's berating him for being an idiot. She's slapped him. <laughs> she just called him a vagina. The female Ghostbusters are better. Not that I've watched the old ones, but. They just kiss. Leland breakfast and Ben are about to throw it down. They're about to throw it down. Dr. Universe. 
He just punched Ben in the face. Leland breakfast is so mean. Ew. It's greatest power is butt stuff. Everyone in the practice is sticking up for Dr. Reed. They're so sweet. Like, even though they're the weirdest people on the planet, they are just so cute and loyal. It's nice. And Ben and Mindy are official. There's the big window again. And scene.